part of our preparation for the Rio Olympics, it was hugely vital that everybody that stepped on that pitch understood their strengths and that the whole team valued each other's contribution. So where that starts really is, first of, you, first of all, you looking internally and going, what is it that I'm great at? Now, if, you, if I was to ask you to stand up in front of everybody and go, this is what I'm great at, and it, not just explain your job title, but what are the human qualities as well as your intellect uh, and what it is you bring to that team, I can assure you, you probably feel very uncomfortable. But that's a place we needed to get to. So first and foremost, it was look internally. What is it that I'm good at? Then to gain information from your coaches, from your peers, from your teammates, because there will be things that others see in you that you don't necessarily see. There'll be expectations your teammates have of you because they know that you have some incredible qualities that they need. So you have to know that, you have to write them down, you have to own it, because that also is the core to your self-confidence. It's the one thing that you have control over. So first of all, understanding your, your super strengths, then sharing them. So ultimately for a team to perform under pressure, you have to know where to find the answer because it's not gonna be the captain that has the, the solution to every problem. So either the captain can find which individual has the strength to meet the, the problem that's in front of them, or more importantly, the individual has the confidence to step forward and say, I can solve that problem. So in a moment in a semi-final, when a coach is delivering a, a team talk at half time, if the player that would never normally say a word steps forward and goes, actually, I understand the tactical problem that's going on because I'm in it. How about we do this? And the coach is able to step back and let that person talk. That is incredible. And they know that the strength of that individual uh, and the contribution they make in that moment will, will ultimately um, enable that team to, to perform even better. So whilst that person wasn't asked to contribute, they stepped forward. That, is, that dynamic is, is equally important. Ultimately, it enables you to perform without feeling um, unnecessary pressure to go above and beyond. So if I start trying to dribble around half the, the Dutch team to score a goal, we are not going to be successful. Because it's the Olympic final, do I think I could be a hero here? I can win the winning goal. I'm a forward, I should score all of a sudden I'm putting heaps of pressure on my own performance and I'm, I'm no longer delivering skills that are necessarily um, vital for the team's performance as a whole. So I have to ensure that um, I understand the team appreciates my contribution no matter how small. So regardless of whether you've got the title of the star player or you've got the title of captain and you've had that for 13 years, those individuals still respect the, the smaller roles that people may view externally. So my role in the team is largely to point and tell people where to go. It's to set up uh, the press tactically. It's to create space on the pitch for others to perform. So if you're watching on TV, you'll see me disappearing out of shot in the opposite direction. It's not because I'm scared to get on the ball, it's because I'm creating a large channel through the middle of the pitch for Kate at the back to pass the ball to Lily at the front. That will give us the best chance of scoring a goal. So equally, if Lily then scores a goal, I'm celebrating like I've just scored, standing on the sideline, because I know that that performance that I've just delivered is what is expected of my team and gives us the best chance of winning. If everybody understands that, everyone owns their strengths, they know what they're delivering, they know that all they have to do is what they're already great at, it's what they do every single day in training, then that is truly um, world class in terms of um, team performance.